hello friends welcome back to code tonight in today's video we will see how to solve error microsoft a solid db 12.0 provider is not registered on the local machine so this is the error that you get in the OLED db connection while you are trying to import excel using OLED db in asp.net so this is the error that we are getting right now and we will see how to solve that so for solving this we have to install one component in your system so this is a component that we have to install the name of the component is 2007 office system driver data connectivity component now for getting the link what you have to do is you can open cotonite.com uh, we will provide a link for that with the video you can open the blog related to the error and here you will see a link that will actually get you to the page where you can download the component so you have to download the component from here and after the i have already downloaded one of these so you have to double click on that and click on yes So now you have to click on next here, you have to click on I accept the terms, click on next. Here is the location, you just have to click on install. So the component is installed now and now we have a microsoft access engine in the system and now if we try to uh, stop the application once and try to rerun the application so this is a sample excel that i have attached here for reading the data and i am providing the connection here and connection.open is working now and now it will get the data uh, from the excel file and it will fill the data into the data table so you can see the excel data is here now so now uh, you will not get the error uh, which we are getting earlier so in case you still face any issue then you can again uh, go to the blog uh, that from the site that we have shared here this is the first solution that i have just explained to you uh, uh, in most cases that will work fine so if that doesn't work then what we have to do is you have to download second redistributable file so you have to click on this link and rest of the steps are explained here that you have to download one exe from here and again after that after installing that file you have to restart the system and after that just try to access the OLED TV connection once more uh, this will help you out uh, in most of the cases this is the uh, only reason that for the issue that uh, your system doesn't have the uh, microsoft access engine in your system so this is how you can fix the issue and uh, if uh, this works for you then don't forget to share the blog and share the video also and if you face any kind of issue then you can also add a comment here and we will try to help you out so thanks for watching guys and don't forget to support